Hello everyone. In this video, we will see how the voice data can be converted into text. This is a video on Python code. So if you are not aware about Python, I have already created a video on Python basics so that you will get the idea of basics of Python and can start this coding. So how we can convert a voice to text? This can be done through the package installer of Python. So we will be installing three package. One is for speech recognition. Then second one is for audio and third one is for writing the data into text. So PYTT SX3. So these are three kind of package installer we will be installing in our code using pip command. So I am going to open a terminal. So first thing is to install pip install speech recognition. That's it. This has been installed. Now when I will import this speech recognition, it will import it successfully. Second thing is to import the py text to speech x3. But this will not come here because this will not be recognized unless we will be installing three things. So we have installed only one thing that is speech recognition. Now I am going to install second one. Pip install py audio. And as you can see, this has also been installed. Now last one is pip install py text to speech x3. And this will also be installed. After these three installation, automatically this will go away. As you can see, this is gone. Now let's clear it out. Since speech recognition is quite a long name, so I am making it as alias of speech recognition. So wherever speech recognition S R E C will come, it will be considered as speech recognition only. Now first, after the import has been done, we need to create a recognizer. For creation of recognizer, let me name it as recognizer rec equals this speech recognition dot recognizer. That's it. We need to have these three things in our code. After speech recognition has been created as a recognizer, we need to create a definition or create a function in which we will be speaking the data and the data will be produced as text. For that, we need to create a function, let the function name is speak and in that we need to pass the text data. After this initialization of this definition has been done, we need to create the engine to start and say the text data. For that we need to create an engine, name it engine only and after this engine has been made, we need to call the py text to speech x3 to initialize the engine. Once this engine has been initialized, we will say that hey engine, just say the text which has been provided in as a text data. And once this has been done, then I will call for engine to await termination and terminate if it is not running. So run await. So in this way, we are able to write the definition of speech or speak data which has been provided. Now once this definition is done, then we will go with the writing of code using try catch block of getting the data from the user as a voice and writing as a text. So I will do a try with speech recognition as REC, the synonym which or you can say the alias which I have created for speech recognition and call for the microphone to be used and this will be used as a source make it a source too and this source will be called and then we will call the recognizer dot adjust the background or adjust the ambient noise in which we will be passing few parameters and first is to provide the source which has been passed here that is source too and duration that after how many time or how much time the code will wait for 
considering that this voice is complete. Suppose I am saying, hey, hey Python write me a text code and it should not suddenly keep on writing whatever I am saying, but it should wait for a certain pause. Then after that pause, pause only, it should write the code. So let's provide a duration of one second, somewhat like that. Then go for text and data, which we will be receiving. And I'll call the recognizer dot recognize whatever it is coming. And as you can see, recognizer Google is already there. We can recognize it through that. And I will call the recognizer to listen to the source data, which is coming from the user. So it will be source to. And as you can see, recognizer is listening and is passing to the recognizer Google and it is coming out as a text data. Simple. And we will be directly printing this data. And we'll say first part as user input is and post that we will say this text data which is coming. And I also will go and say that speak function which we have called then pass and let the user data come out as a speak also or you can say the engine will provide as a and say in the background suppose our text data which is coming here which will be printed here and also it will be spoken through the python code so for that only we will pass the text data to the speak function which we have created and through this engine will start it and say here the text data which has been provided and automatically run and await. Now this trick is complete. Let's go with the catch part. If any exception will come, except speech recognizer SREC dot request. request error as e then automatically what to do print directly exception occurred and which exception has occurred we will say it as this dot format the exception which is coming that is the e exception which is coming now also there are chances that other exception will also come so so i'll write as a rec dot unknown value which will be coming and this will be coming and directly will be saying that data not received from user So everything is complete now. Let's go with the duration of 0.1 second and let's run it and keep on checking whether the voice is coming similar to the text or not. So I'm going after just running, I will say something and this will be recognized as a text and also this will be speak through this speak function and this code will be used as a, data, a medium to speak the data. This is a Python code to recognize voice as text. Python code to recognize voice as text. So automatically you can see this is part is as in missed, but Python code to recognize text is coming here. Also, let me try it one more time. Voice to text recognition. To text recognition. Somewhat like that it is coming. Now let's do certain operations. If I am changing the duration here to one second, this will wait for one second, a pause of one second, then only it will come out. So this is a text data and it will be provided in console using voice. and it will be provided in console using voice. 
so as you can see certain duration has been increased right now now i am going to instead of running it every time i am going to provide a while loop and so i'll write a while inside the while i'll make it as true every time for that true i am writing one now the try and catch block will come out here and make it tab one time now this will not be stopped or i will not be starting every time this program so automatically every time whatever i will say it will keep on running and keep on writing the text p so i am writing here running it here run my text data run my text data correct it is already coming and automatically whatever i am saying it will keep on writing this because i have already provided a while loop here is already coming and automatically whatever i am saying it will keep on writing this because i already provided while loop here one more thing uh, if i am not saying anything then it will automatically come out in this except, exception part and it will say data not received from user but whatever i said right now it will be coming here post that we will see with a pause that data will not be received from the user if i am not saying anything not received from user but whatever i said right now it will be coming here post that we will see with a pause the data will not be received from the user see after that exception occurred and you can see error came but this is not coming let me change it to request error now after this request error i will take a pause this was i think a typo there now run it and let's take a pause for certain time second time see i'm not saying anything it is saying data not received from user but right now i said so it will print the data i am not saying anything not received from user but right now i said so it will print data see every time i am not saying anything i have taken a big pause so data not received from user is coming and this program is again going <coughs> into the loop and it will keep on running this data until unless this terminates because i applied a while loop with try catch block so this is about how we can use our voice to run as a text part so speech recognition one thing is to consider it. py audio and py text to speech x3 these three things are there it should be used to run this program you can go with the py and speech recognition part using the pip install packages or python installer packages and directly you can use the recognizer engine to say the data and also the recognizer to recognize the text which is coming and can print the data easily i am not saying anything i have taken a big boss so did not receive only there is coming and this program is again going into the loop and it will keep on running status for this is about how we can use our voice to run as a text part so speech recognition one thing is to computer programming so this was about voice to text thank you all for watching my video Sadish, what about voice to text? Thank you all for watching my video.